How's it going everyone? Welcome to my YouTube channel, Path to Wellness. In today's video, I'm gonna discuss the fastest way to lose fat, improve health, and gain strength. So if you're not yet subscribed to my channel, please click the subscribe button and check the bell so you're notified of my new videos. Thanks a lot. So, <clears throat> in my opinion, the best way to do this is you combine a clean diet with intermittent fasting and exercise. And I'm gonna break these down briefly. So, number one is clean foods. Now, there's a lot of varying opinions on what humans should be eating, but it's my opinion that fruit and green salads are definitely healthy. I know some people might disagree with that, and there's a lot of disagreement on what other foods we should be eating. But from my personal experience and from my research, I suggest definitely eating fruits and green salads. Definitely fit for humans. So no matter what type of diet you're following, I suggest getting those foods in every day that you eat. Now, when you combine clean foods with intermittent fasting, you're gonna even have greater benefits for health and, and wellness. So if you haven't done intermittent fasting or you don't know what that is, it's um, when you eat a specified window of time each day. And if you're new to it, I'd suggest starting out slow with a, maybe a 16-8 routine where you eat in an eight hour window and you fast for 16 hours every day. So let's say you eat between noon and 8 p.m. and you fast the rest of the time. Now, from there, you can work your way to a two meal a day routine where you say you eat lunch and dinner, but you don't snack in between. So it's maybe a six to seven hour eating window. And for even better benefits and results, you can go to a one meal a day routine or just have one eating window. Let's say you eat from 4 p.m. to 7 p.m or something such as that. And I personally eat more water-rich foods. I include fruit and things like that. So I do about a three to four hour window. That works well for me. And if you're eating more dense foods, you can definitely even shorten that window. So that's gonna give your body the most time you know, to heal and recover. And if you wanna take it a step for, further from there, I suggest uh, incorporating intermittent dry fasting into your routine. So that means when you're doing the fasting, either a certain number of days or every day or whatever, whatever you work in, you're dry fasting, so you're not having any water. So you have all your food and water in a specified window. Now this gives the body the most time to heal and recover. And especially for, there's different health conditions, well, virtually mo most health conditions that I'm aware of, this is going to help heal. And I have a good example for myself. Back years ago, I used to get back problems back aches um, during certain times and they'd come up maybe once every year or two and this was before I knew about fasting or dry fasting but once the last time this happened was about a year and a half ago and I had this back problem where my back was hurting and but at this time I knew about dry fasting and fasting so I put in a routine where I was doing a 22 hour dry fast intermittent dry fast with a two hour eating window and my back was better within two and a half days. It was like completely better. Normally it'd take about three weeks to get better. So since then I really haven't had any back problems um, and I incorporate intermittent dry fasting into my routine regularly. Um, so the other aspect of this is you wanna incorporate exercise. So I personally like to do calisthenics, yoga, hiking, but whatever it may be, when you incorporate exercise with clean food and intermittent fasting, you're gonna have the best results as far as fat loss, as far as improvement in your health and strength and everything like that. So figure out an exercise you like to do, maybe find people to exercise with if you're having trouble getting motivated. And I also have a lot of videos where I give examples of routines on my YouTube channel, and they're very simple routines, easy to follow, and you can, whether you're a beginner and advanced, uh, they're all, they're great routines. So I suggest checking some of those out. So this protocol um, that I just went over, it's not only gonna help you health-wise and have you have a nice, you know, the best body you can mentally and physically, it's gonna, help you pretty much in every way, aspect of life, and give you strength, and it's gonna give you um, basically discipline. And it's gonna bring you to other levels that you weren't at before. So definitely suggest doing this protocol. And, um, you know, 
combine that intermittent fasting with a healthy diet and exercise for the best health and fitness results. So I hope you liked the video. If so, give it a thumbs up. Please share it with anyone interested in learning more about this stuff. And um, thanks again, thanks for watching. And leave any comments below of what you're doing right now. What, are you do, what is your experience with intermittent fasting, dry fasting, things like that. So thanks a lot and have a good day.